Hey everybody, I have a video here for you today and I've had some questions on Angkor Wat and some links left and I appreciate those. And I have not talked about Angkor Wat for probably a couple of years so I thought this was a good time to make a video on Angkor Wat. This is one of those sites from around the world and we're flying into Cambodia here. This is one of those sites from around the world that I highly doubt the standard model of history's dating of this site. Here is the main temple complex in Angkor Wat. But new imaging has shown that this city is massive and sprawling and there are many things underneath the overgrowth here. And I'll be showing you that at the end. But why do I think Angkor Wat is much more ancient than the standard model of history says or very well could be? Well, it's been what has been found in the core of the temple at Angkor Wat, huge megalithic uh, blocks with these metal block ties that uh, metal or copper was poured into to attach these megalithic blocks. This has been found at Giza, Tiwanaku, Pumapunku, some of the oldest sites in the world, Oliente Tambo. Were they using a technique thousands of years old, just a thousand years ago, at Angkor Wat? Well, I kind of highly doubt that. Now here is a video I did three years ago off the top of my head as a response to a Nazca line video I did. And this is one of my most watched videos, but you notice this is Nazca right here. And I just plotted the lines out of Nazca. And they all converge at the spot exactly halfway around the world. And that is Angkor Wat. Is that just a coincidence that Nazca and Angkor Wat are exactly half the way around the world from each other? Well, I think that is a question worth bringing up. And another thing about the location of Angkor Wat, let me just read you this here. The Greek letter phi signifies the golden section. And if you watch videos on the Great Pyramid, you know that phi or the golden section is incorporated into the Great Pyramid. Well, let me just read you this. It says Angkor Wat is 4,745 miles from the Great Pyramid, and the Great Pyramid is 7,670 miles from Nazca. This is a precise expression of the golden section, or phi. Is that just a coincidence? The distance is the exact golden section in these three ancient sites, Nazca, Giza, and Angkor Wat. I think that is totally fascinating. I will leave some links below. But getting back to what's under the ground at Angkor Wat, let me just show you a video where I strip away the vegetation in some LiDAR imaging and just show you what it looks like under the ground. I hope you thought this was interesting. Angkor Wat, I believe, is much more ancient than we are told. Hope you thought this was interesting, and you all have a very nice day.